Assalamu alaikum. Uh, today we will talk about uh, Honex, uh, which is a security based operating system. Um, it's special for uh, and specially designed for advanced privacy and anonymity. Uh, it actually uh, focuses on keeping your online activities uh, private and anonymous, and uh, it usually works by splitting your uh, internet connections into two separate parts. Uh, so no one actually can track your uh, or trace back uh, your activities online. Uh, this is usually used by bicycle hackers, hackers and journalists, uh, activists. Um, it's kind of like virtual machines, but with 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 more uh, security focus regards to the internet activity. So now let's start. Just getting uh, how to install it. It's uh, Linux based, so um, you can just search it on Google. Uh, Honex, search it on Google, and you just go through it. <clears throat> you will find actually it can be adapted to many systems <clears throat> when you download it, and it shows also the why it's better than VBNs. <clears throat> Sorry. So many informations actually regards to the Honex, you will find it on the website. It's a free uh, tool and open source also. Uh, has been supported by Tor browser, uh, OnionShare and uh, others. <coughs> so now let's go through the installation. Uh, download first. So in our case here, uh, there is so many systems you can download, even for USB, actually you can download it for USB, VirtualBox, and uh, for Linux. Uh, in my case, I will download it for Linux and especially for Kali. There is no specific installations for Kali, but I will actually install like uh, uh, VirtualBox on Kali, and then I will um, import uh, the Honex inside Kali inside the virtual box of Kali and then I can uh, work it at that at that moment so usually uh, Ubuntu you will find some installation for it it's too easy but for Kali you cannot find <coughs> here is the manual installations for uh, virtual box in our case here in case that you are using Windows or even using Mac or whatever you can also Install VirtualBox first, and then you can import uh, Honex inside the VirtualBox, and it will work very fine actually. In my case, here I will just download it, I already downloaded it before, so yeah, that, that's uh, how you download it, and it's all based on Tor. Actually, Tor now I don't know why it's not working anymore, but uh, you can install it using Terminal, and it will be installed already with Honex, so. Uh, regards to the installations of VirtualBox uh, in Kali, you can just um, write it on Gemini or any uh, chatbots, um, ChatGPT or whatever, and follow the, the command lines in your terminal of uh, Kali. Uh, for sure, it starts with sudo uh, apt updates, and then it followed by sudo install the dependence or require dependence for the uh, VirtualBox first. Uh, in my case here, when I copy it, I just uh, clicked Control Shift and V, so I can uh, paste it in the terminal. Uh, or you can just go to the VirtualBox downloads, and you will find it there, um, or the package. In that regard, so you can just download it from the VirtualBox directly. Uh, I'm just downloading now the kind of like virtual machine, the virtual box, it's kind of virtual machine, so I can use it to operate uh, my Honex, the version of Honex, okay, which is also Linux. Honex actually is a kind of Linux, but with more security uh, uh, layers. Uh, also the same, you can download also Honex in, in the same way on Kali. Uh, in my case here, I installed the Tor on Kali. I was trying to install Tor on Kali, also using command lines, the Tor browser. Uh, once you installed everything, you can just import uh, Honex inside the VirtualBox, and it have all the instructions here with the images. 
on the website and then start your Honex, you will find that it has two main, main files, the gateway and the workstation. So now let's uh, open our pressure box. And as you see here, you file and you can just import the two files. I already imported, so I have the Honex gateway and the Honex workstation. You have to work the gateway first, just double click on it. It will be opened. Just keep it until it's like the Linux operating system actually it takes some time until it's it start. Now it's okay, it's running, is that the gateway? And then I will just take it out a little bit and I will go through the workstation to open the workstation. <coughs> Here you find the workstation and it will take also the same almost same time like the gateway now here is your Honex okay it's a very secured OS that you can do whatever you want here no one can trace you back so let's open our tool browser inside it and let's test it now about my location let's click on the IP check here down you can find the connection uh, as, as, as you know or as you may try before um, usually Tor is a bit slow uh, now I will open Google <coughs> here's a virtual machines and actually uh, behind this is Kali is working so you can work in both of them so that's the point Yeah, and our terminal in here so let's say who am I it's actually we'll say just I'm a user it's like a different OS system generally seem like WSL on Windows or uh, any virtual machines uh, you have two systems already working so I will open Tor also on my Kali and it's a bit slow now because I'm already using it inside the virtual box so let's check the settings here there's no gateway you will not find gateway same as store in any other OS system because already this is a gateway so you will not find any bridges or something this most of the applications that on Honex you can install more from the terminal if you want or you can just make it more specific to whatever needs you want here tour on the Kali you will find the bridges so I can just activate the bridges regards to the tour on Kali but you cannot find these bridges actually on Honex I guess because it already has bridge it already has a gateway behind so it's very secure so now I will turn it off and then also I will turn the power off the gateway now it's fine close the virtual box it's all okay now let's open Tor here and check if it will work back so I will connect it now now yeah now it's connected and it's working fine let's check uh, where is my location if it works okay yeah, my location is Turkmenistan. Yeah, Turkmenistan. So for sure, I'm not there. Thank you.